Hey everybody, it's Will from Blizzard Lighting. I've got some exciting fixtures to show you today. What you're looking at here is Blizzard's Verismo line of professional LED ellipsoidals and Fresnels. These are Blizzard's flagship LED theatrical fixtures and they come with a choice of either a 300 watt warm white or 300 watt RGB ALC, that's red, green, blue, amber, lime, cyan, LED. In the profile of the ellipsoidal, we've got lens options of 19, 26, 36, or 50 degrees. And I mentioned the two different types of LEDs. These are both very high CRI LED modules. The color mixing uh, module gives you a CRI of at least 95 in either uh, fixture. And with the warm white, that's particularly CRI optimized. In the Fresnel, you're looking at an astonishing CRI of greater than 98, and in the Leco, greater than 97. It's gonna do wonders for your skin tone reproduction, it's gonna make even me look pretty good. Let's take a little bit more of a look. I'm gonna talk a little more about the LED choices that we've got in these uh, here in a second. But first, all of the Resmo fixtures are ETL listed. They all have PowerCon True One compatible in and out power connections and three and five pin DMX. It's gonna make them pretty easy to adapt into any existing system that might be out there. Uh, beyond that, I really like the uh, menu and setup uh, options that are on this. So the fixture's got a built-in OLED or organic LED display at the back uh, with a four button control interface. It makes them really easy to set up. It's very easy to read uh, in a variety of different lighting conditions. And it's, uh, it's well thought out, if I do say so myself. Beyond that, the electronics in this are also, um, again, in line with being a flagship fixture. We've got an adjustable PWM refresh rate of between 1,000 and 6,000 hertz. Uh, you're gonna be able to use these in a variety of different situations, pretty much any camera shutter speed or uh, frame rate that you might wanna throw at it. I think I mentioned this, but uh, also for the, the profile, 19, 26, 36, and 50 degree lens tubes available. Uh, and also these will in fact fit uh, competitor lenses. So um, getting a little bit more into the LEDs here. I mentioned the two options. There's a 300 watt warm white and the 300 watt RGB ALC. So if you're looking for the widest possible color palette, obviously you're gonna to wanna to go with the color mixing. And there's traditionally been a trade off with, uh, particularly with rendering skin tones and then having color mixing LEDs. Well, the six color color mixing in the RGB ALC uh, fixture, we, we're, we're, we're trying to mitigate that a little bit. And the way we do that is by adding those other colors and particularly the lime. So when you look at a conventional white light, light source, what you're really seeing is a pretty broad even distribution of uh, over the entire visible spectrum of light. And with LEDs, because they have very intense uh, but very small centers of output, you end up missing quite a bit of the spectrum. So adding more different colors of LEDs will help smooth that out. And because human beings see the most in the greenish sort of spectrum, it makes most sense to add them there. So that's what we did. And the result is Again, a very, very high CRI for, uh, particularly for a color mixing fixture. It's greater than 95. Beside the control panel and all of the connectivity options you have with these fixtures, the rest of the electronics are also very well designed and well thought out. You've got 16-bit dimming with four user-selectable dimming curves. You've also got variable PWM from 1,000 to 8,000 hertz. You're gonna be able to record uh, in a variety of different frame rates, shutter speeds, whatever you like, and you're not gonna have any issues with LED flickering. The color temperature of the warm white, 3200 degrees Kelvin, and again with a CRI of 97 in the uh, profile or 98 in the Fresnel, man, it's gonna make, it's gonna make your, your skin really, really look nice. And if you're looking for really the ultimate in color mixing, the six color RGB ALC is the way to go. And again, we've done quite a bit to optimize the CRI of that by adding those additional colors to sort of smooth out the frequency response over the entire visible spectrum of light. Let's see, what else can I tell you here? Uh, the Fresnel here, 18 to 65 degree motorized zoom. That's pretty impressive. On the uh, profile, you got your standard framing shutters over here. I already just uh, took the gobo holder out, comes with the gobo holder, takes a standard B-size gobo. And beyond the standard 19, 26, 36, and 50 degree lenses that you can get from us, uh, it may work pretty well with other readily available uh, lens tubes that are out there. Good things come from Wisconsin. I guess that's all I'm saying. Uh, beyond that, again, just if you take a look at the uh, CRI and other specs, the output of these fixtures compared to the competition, and in particular at the price point that these are gonna be at, uh, there's, they, they compare very, very favorably. So again, when we compare these to the competition, the other fixtures that are available out there in the market, 
higher CRI, more output, at a very attractive price point for all of them. Uh, again, there's gonna be four versions of the fixtures. There's Fresnel's, and those are available with the warm white or RGB ALC LED engine, and then the profiles, same thing, warm white or RGB ALC. And then the uh, lens options, the 19, 26, 36, and 50. And for even more information, and to, or to find a dealer near you, that's gonna be able to help uh, get these guys for you. You can visit blizzardpro.com slash verismo. That's blizzardpro.com slash verismo. Uh, beyond that, tell us what you guys wanna see next in a video and we'll do our best to make it happen. Thanks for sticking around with me, I appreciate it. See you next time.